You know, there's one thing these uh, old pony cars have a lot in common is, is gauge problems. It could be the gas gauge, it could be the temperature gauge, uh, it could be your oil pressure sending unit, and they're fairly simple things to diagnose. And I'm going to give you a tip on how to diagnose them, at least on the Mustangs and even on some of these GMs. What you got behind the instrument cluster after you take these screws out is, of course, a series of wires that lead to all the gauges back here. But one thing they have in common is this thing here, which is called a voltage limiter. And what it does is it, it feeds constant voltage to one side, and then coming out of it to each one of the gauges is a pulse of current. Now, Ford figured that out a long time ago, and they still use this kind of thing on cars today. And the reason why they want a pulse of current is so if you take a turn real quickly with your, uh, with your car around a turn, and the gas gauge just will fly up. A lot of GM products do not have voltage limiters, and that's why a GM car like this old Camaro I'm working on here, if you take a turn too quickly, the gas gauge flies up over to full. You go the other way, the gas gauge flies down to empty. That's because it's getting the voltage too quickly, too fast. Ford figured out if, if you just do a pulse of current, that it'll allow it a little bit of time to kind of lag around, and it won't be so sensitive. So when you pull your dash apart, and you take your cluster apart, Make sure you got current, solid current to one side of this uh, voltage limiter, and coming out the other side, you'll have pulse current. And then to one side of each one of the gauges back here, you're going to have pulse current leading to it, and then coming out of the other side is going to be pulse current leading to the sending unit that corresponds to that, which I'll show you what that is too. So let's lead on to the sending units, and I'll show you how easy it is to, to get those out and how to diagnose those too.